Hey guys, Midwest Fishing Bros, back again with another video. Um, today, I'm going to do a little product review on JJ's Magic Dipping Dye with Garlic Oil. This is the chartreuse color. I know it comes in kind of a reddish pink color, um, a clear, a couple other colors, maybe even like a blue, blue color. Um, but I'm going to dip some baits for, for you to show you how, um, how I do some of my baits and to, to, to give you an idea of how this works. Um, so the lid, or the whole thing could actually be under pressure, so it asks you to open it really, uh, really carefully and slowly. And after you get it open, you can just set the cap off to the side. Um, the first bait that I'm going to dip is a craw color or a craw bait. This is kind of a watermelon candy. This is actually a packer craw. And I'm going to go ahead and dip the uh, craws for you. You only have to put it in there for um, three to five seconds and then let it air dry. Now I'm doing this color because I want to show you that not all the colors turn out like you would think. Okay, so you kind of have to um, play with it a little bit. I'm going to let that dry. Okay. Now, as you can see, it definitely changed the colors of the claws a little bit, about halfway up. Um, now, it's not a super bright color. I'll try to... Oh, uh, yeah, I'm going to get it all over my finger. But it's not a super bright color. But you can definitely tell that it is a little bit brighter. Um, now, I'm going to move to a Cinco. And this one should be a lot brighter. So let's just say you want to dye the tip of the Cinco. I'm going to hold it in there for about three to five seconds. I'm going to pull it out, let it dry. And there you can see that the tip of the Cinco is dyed. Now it's actually, I think it's coming out a lot better than the claws. It's kind of hard to see it. Um, and then if you wanted to, you could even flip it over and dye this side. I really like to do this, especially if I'm wacky rigging um, a Cinco. And just like that, you have a light color right here, darker, and then light. Now on these baits, you should be able to, to tell that they are dipped really, really well. So I'm going to do this uh, swim bait tail. I really love to do this on uh, chatter baits and uh, those types of trailers. And look how good that looks right there. So this is that is what um, a swim bait would look like. I also have one of these bottom hoppers made by Berkeley. I'll go ahead and dip that for you. I like to dip the balls of this bait. And, and I'm not really sure how this color is going to work out. I've never dipped this color. I usually dip... Um, kind of like the watermelon colors and they come out really well but you kind of just have to play around with it I mean um, this is a trial and error, error type of thing to do and once you get the hang of it 
the baits that you really like to use, you'll notice. I mean, you on this bait, you can see the the different color, how it changed it. That's actually kind of cool. And the last bait that I'm going to um, do is a tube. And I really like to do this. You dip the little tentacles in there. Let it dry. And look at that. That is awesome. So as you can see, it works a lot better with lighter colored baits, but uh, I mean, look at the look at the claws now. I mean, it's it looks really good. Go ahead and show you some of these baits again. Here's the Cinco. You can definitely tell. And after you dip these and let them dry for air dry for about 10 to 15 seconds. You just throw them in the water, and I mean, I've fished, oh gosh, I threw a couple hundred casts, and the dye is still on there. Here's this. Here's the bottom hopper. Kind of came out like a really dark green. Not sure how well you can see that in this light. And then here's the tube, which looks really good. So, you kind of just have to uh, play with the dye. Um, I've only used this color. Um, I'm sure the other colors work great on different types of baits. You just like this color works good on light colored baits. But that's the review of the JJ's Magic Dip and Dye, a great product. Um, you can definitely tell a difference with the garlic scent on there. I, uh, it catches more fish and the color just makes these, these baits pop in the water. So go on over. I, they sell this at Tackle Warehouse. Um, they sell it at JJ'sMagic.com. Go ahead, go check them out. And uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks, guys.